Hey everyone, it's Keith here from Seven Brothers. We're here today to try a couple of beers. One in particular is our Honeycomb Pale Ale. I uh, hope you guys are having a great time with the Beer 52 Cyberfest. So in a minute, we'll crack this one open and we'll tell you all about it. Cheers. One of the first questions we do get asked is, uh, are we actually Seven Brothers? And the answer is yes. So the name was pretty easy to come by. Uh, we established uh, back in 2014, uh, so I'm trading uh, about six years now. And we've just gone from strength to strength uh, from a very small brewing kit with only 5,000 litres of uh, fermenting capacity uh, to, the, to the brewery that you see now, which is 60,000 litres of fermenting capacity and a much, much uh, more sophisticated setup. So, um, how did we get into craft beer? Well, um, we actually grew up making homebrew um, with our dad and we all kind of got into it um, in different, different stages in our lives. And that's where it all started for us. Some of us got into it a little bit more than others. Uh, so our brother Kit, for instance, he was our first head brewer. He, um, he was also a science teacher before he got into this full time. And uh, he was the one who went out and got some, um, some quals and uh, learned how to make, start making beer. So we've obviously, um, you know, gone on from strength to strength. Uh, we're actually, uh, you know, from a, from a family point of view, we're all self-taught. Um, and we've made all the mistakes under the sun in terms of uh, making uh, quality, consistent craft beer. Um, we do have an amazing team behind us now from, uh, from uh, the brewing team. Uh, we, have, we have Greg, he's, our, he's one of the brothers and he's our lead technical brewer. Uh, we have Jack, who joined our team a few years ago now and he's our creative head brewer. Then we have, we have Eddie, Eddie's uh, one of our assistant brewers and uh, always got something to say uh, about which direction we should go in, which is perfect. And then we have Dan, who's another one of our assistant brewers. And then we have, we have Harry. Harry's uh, one of our newest additions to the team and um, he's already showing some, some great, great, great promise, but he's getting stuck into the nitty gritty uh, of the brewing side of things. So as well as our brewery here, we have, um, we have our own bars as well, which we've been opening since 2016. We call them our Seven Brothers Beer Houses. Uh, we have our first one in Ancoats in Manchester, our second one just on the outskirts of Manchester, and we've got our third and fourth opening in Liverpool and Leeds in the next six months. So we're really, really excited about that. And we hopefully, you know, it's uh, more, more places for you guys to come and try our craft beer. Uh, also, where I'm sat at the moment is our brand new brewery tap. We've uh, basically taken everything up. So you can see all the brewery floor down there. Uh, we've now got this amazing space up here. And we've got the brewery uh, that we've built ourselves over there. And yeah, strange times, and we've only just been open the last few weeks. Um, but as lockdown eases and people's confidence comes back, we hopefully we're hopefully going to be having loads and loads and loads of people come here um, over the next months, months ahead. All right, guys, so uh, we're here today to taste our honeycomb pale. You should have this beer in your Beer 52 Cyberfest box. So we're just going to uh, have a little bit of a taster, and I'll give you some, uh, some notes I've got written down here about the beer, actually. Um, and I'll just tell you all about it. So here we go guys, we're gonna crack this one open. So in this particular beer, we've got a, a variety of malts. We have uh, our base, best ale malt. Uh, we've got a caramel. We have caramel for a little bit of sweetness and color. And we have crystal malt, malt as well. And there's only just there's a, only a small amount of crystal malt that we use. So as you can see, it's a beautiful colour. Absolutely great colour. So I suggest you guys give it a, a bit of a sniff. The first thing I get is lots of you know rich caramel honeycomb uh, aroma. Um, instantly, I can, I, can I can taste that it's um, it's a honey based beer. So, you guys, tell me what you think. We'll have a swig. Let's give it a try. What a lot of people are, I think, feed, feeding back um, to us on this particular beer is that it's like tasting crunchy in a can. And um, it's, um, it's, it's proven really, really popular over the last six months that this, this beer has been available. Um, it really it does pack a punch. Um, and it's all so vegan, so um, you guys who are all vegans, get yourself down to a web shop to get some more of this. And um, yeah, hope you enjoy it. Cheers.